Good morning, everyone. I wanted to offer you my personal greetings. This is a very difficult time. Many of us are not in the contact with others that we're accustomed to, and it really affects us, even though we're being very wise to not be. Uh, I'm working from home. I'm staying safe. My team is determined that I'm really not, uh, shouldn't expose myself any more than necessary. The people who can work remotely in my clinic are working remotely. Everyone else is there, is taking good care of patients, is staying safe themselves. Thank goodness we have not had any illness. Uh, we're not receiving anyone in the clinic except patients. Uh, guests and drivers wait downstairs. Patients have their temperature taken immediate, immediately when they come in. And of course, they're spoken with the day before. If they have any sign of illness, they're asked to reschedule. Uh, my staff is wearing gloves, masks, uh, taking good care to wipe everything down. We're really quite busy. This is a terribly triggering time for patients. And I wanted to let you know that we're here. We're available to help you if you need help. We want you to stay safe, but this is not a reason to defer maintaining your own well-being. In fact, it's very important that you have the concentration and the focus and the energy that this treatment can give you in order to make good choices, and to keep yourself safe. We all miss contact. I would love to be hugging my grandchildren. I'd love to be hugging my out-of-town children. But um, this too will pass. It's not going to be a sprint. It's a marathon. You have to put something in place that you have a routine. You have to keep yourself primarily safe and hang in there. This is going to be over. Things will be better, but not nearly so quickly as we would hope. We're here for you. You'll see more video later in the newsletter. Uh, stay safe and stay in touch.